In women with premature ovarian failure that are menopausal, say at age 30, we think it's over and we always recommend donor eggs, which they often don't want. Well, what we discovered with ovary transplants was totally unexpected, that you get a rapid recruiting, over-recruiting of resting follicles, an amazingly massive over-recruiting, because you're lowering the tissue pressure and then you're putting it back on to the uh, ovarian medulla and so pressure controls that rate of release of eggs and suddenly you get a massive outpouring, a real big release of eggs from the cortex. Well, there are always a few eggs in the cortex of women that you think have no more eggs. You will always find a few beautiful, normal eggs, but they can't get out because the number has gone down so much, there's an inhibitory mechanism and the cortex is holding them and they just, these few remaining eggs can't get out. So you consider she has no eggs, but that's not true. So it's really striking. You can take the ovarian cortex off of their ovaries, these menopausal women, and put it right back on again. You don't even have to freeze it first. You don't even have to incubate it in any enzymes or chemicals. And all of a sudden, you get a release of these eggs, these few eggs that were trapped inside the fibrous tissue of the cortex. Now they won't last that long, but she will start ovulating and she'll be fertile again. It may only last for a year because there aren't many eggs, but you suddenly release those eggs. So we discovered this unexpectedly just by doing our regular ovary transplants. So we have an amazing option now for women with premature ovarian failure that they don't need donor eggs.